You might wanna buckle up, baby. Here we go, here's some more prizes. We got ballast. We got Rex here. The elite squad trooper on card. Oh, nice! There's that Lando. Oh, man. Nice, dude. 20 bucks, okay. And there's Finnick again for 30. Dude, I can get down with these. There's Ahsoka. And our Death Watch Mandalorian. Man, that's why we come to the shows, baby. Come to the shows, because you can find the new stuff long before you see him in stores. That is, if you see him at all. <laughs> this Lando, though, he might be coming home with me. That's too fun. Welcome everybody to Collecting Star Wars. Well, we just got back from Tampa Toy Con, a huge toy show filled with vintage and hard to find modern toys like this Finnish collection Star Wars Battlefront 2 Lando Calrissian. Lando is number 238 in the vintage collection line and he is looking fine, all decked out in tropical apparel. So let's not wait any longer. Let's open him up and have some fun. Can I ask you a question, Captain Calrissian? Anything, Han? It's Han, but that's okay. I heard a uh, story about you. I was wondering if it's true. Everything you've heard about me is true. And now here's Lando out of the box and ready to rock. Let's put on our zoom lens and bring him in for a closer look. And here's our favorite Star Wars smooth criminal. It's Lando Calrissian. And check out this smuggler's face sculpt. A terrific likeness and an expression that is sophisticated and stoic. Really great how this turned out. Going down further, we see this awesome Star Wars equivalent of a Hawaiian shirt. At a distance, it reads like a floral pattern, but up close, it really is just slashes of color of blue and white and red. There's his red scarf with uh, white stripes. Going down, you see his white belt and his gun belt holster with silver buckles. And there on the side is the holster where his blaster fits perfectly. All white pants, nice and clean, and right down to the white shoes that include some really nice brown soles on the bottom with pegs right there in the middle of the foot rather than the high heel that he's wearing. But on the back, you get the all white cape, nice soft goods material with a blue uh, lining on the inside. And there's Lando, looking cool. Taking a step back now, let's look at the full figure and the accessory that he comes with. First of all, we have his awesome silver metallic blaster. Really like this thing. It's all silver except for the little connectors that are black around the scope. Really cool. Love the look of this weapon, especially the long muzzle that he comes with. Nicely done. And the silver just looks great on it. And now, let's get a look again at Lando. Here he is. Man, I gotta tell you, this is without a doubt one of my favorite Lando figures and favorite Lando looks. And let's face it, the brother's got a lot of great looks. And just getting a look at the uh, articulation here. He's got great head tilt. It goes down and up about that far. The arms give you full rotation all the way around and a bend at the elbow. That's pretty decent, just past 90. Little rotation in the wrists, of course. And at the midsection, he's got a little swivel, but not too much crunch or back bend. Doesn't give you too much room there. But the legs give you, uh, the, the knees kick out about that much, about 90 but they go out really far. You can get a full split out of them, so that's cool. And you get some rocker at the ankle as well. So all in all, just what you expect. Really love these characters and how nicely articulated the vintage collection is. And this Lando looks great from his hair to his Hawaiian shirt, right down to those 
rocking white shoes. This Lando is too cool for school. And lastly, let me show you how nicely his blaster fits in the holster on the side of his leg. Works in really well and stays secure, as you can see. Man, I'm really loving this figure, just like I love Donald Glover in the role. I can't wait to see what the series brings. I hope uh, Disney makes Solo 2 happen. And um, while you're at it, Hasbro, give us a L3 figure, one that falls apart just like C-3PO did from Empire Strikes Back, so Lando can lovingly hold L3 in his arms as he says his tearful goodbyes. Let me know in the comments what you think and what figures you want to see, and if you want to see more of this character go forward in Star Wars live action. Finally, in case you were wondering if Lando fits inside the Legacy Falcon, like a glove, baby. <laughs> like a glove. Thank you guys for watching. That's our review of the Star Wars Vintage Collection Battlefront 2 Lando Calrissian. Please like, please subscribe. You can follow us on social media. On Twitter, we are at Stevo Says Stuff. And on Instagram, we're collecting Star Wars YouTube. You can even follow our other YouTube channel for inspirational videos. And that's called Devo with Stevo. But until next time, remember, be kind, stay strong, because you are the hero of your own story. Whatever you say, my lady. Just let me know when you're ready to jump. Ready and... Ready. It's just a simple jump to hyperspace and we're there? What's so tricky about that? Plenty. Can't plot a direct course to Kessel. You have to thread through the psychotic cluster and then pass through the mousetrap. You done flirting? I'm still ready. You might want to buckle up, baby.